Good day YouTube. I thought I'd do a quick teardown of this uh, drag engraver that I built uh, a while ago now. Um, <clears throat> it's worked pretty well and basically um, I built this out of aluminium bar stock. It's got a tensioner there, this end cap screw. It gives a tension on the on the drag engraver itself, on the diamond tip tool. So feed that out and you can see there it gets, it's got less tension on there and increase that and more tension on that on that end tip so let's pull this apart and see what's inside it here we go so you can see there Made a little brass nut to engage on that. Way up, everything's spilling out. So there you go. There's the uh, spring. I'm sure it could have gone with a bigger spring, but again, I just used the equipment that I had in uh, in my workshop at the time. And from there, there's the uh, diamond tip tool. So there's a diamond tip tool that I uh, got off eBay. Turned up this uh, little steel um, collet for it if you like. A uh, little gr retaining grub screw in there. And like I say that's being, let me check. Yeah that's getting pushed on there. So that's, that's what gives it its tension. So here it is now again with the uh, end cap. Uh, screwed back on again you could have machined this really with a shoulder on it I suppose um, which would have probably been a bit nicer but hey ho you can only do what you can do can't you and there you go there's the collet down the end and then if we screw whoa -ho, the spring let's do that spring on so there's a little brass insert there that just fits up nicely into that spring whoa, are we focused yep that's just the uh, that's just a spring that I had lying around and that goes in the end there and let's screw this end cap on and for a very quick project in the workshop which other than buying this diamond tip tool required very little effort um, got a pretty good end result from it and I'll stick some footage of this doing its business in the CNC machine thanks for watching